Welcome to the lead management tutorial video. Displacer management tools are set up to help you manage two different types of leads. This first type of lead comes from the Splacer Marketplace, which means an event organizer came to Splacer, found your space in their search results, and chose to reach out to you based on the photos and information you provided on their listing page. The other leads are those that originate outside of the Splacer Marketplace, which you add to the management tools yourself. This video will review how to manage the first type of lead, those coming from Splacer. For information on how to manage outside leads, please take a look at our sending an invoice and referral tutorial videos. Every new lead from Splacer begins as an inquiry in your pipeline. When an organizer chooses to contact you about renting your space, you will always receive an email notification that contains the message from the organizer. If you click on a lead from Splacer in the table on the pipeline page, you will be redirected to the event details page. This page houses all of the information about the event, including details provided by the event organizer about number of guests and the type of event. These fields are automatically filled in for leads coming from Splicer, but you are able to edit everything other than the status and referral type. Included in this section is a text box for you to keep private notes about the event and organizer. At the bottom of the event details page, you will also find a section for event documents, such as quotes and the Splicer space use agreement, once these documents are created. Next to the details tab on the event page is the messages tab. Clicking here will take you to the conversation with the organizer for this specific event. If you wish to view all of your messages in one place, click on the message icon on the left hand side of the management tool screen. You will most likely message back and forth with the organizer a little bit about details before sending a quote or receiving a quote request. But once you are ready to send the request, just click on the send quote button, which can be found in either the details page or the message page. After clicking send quote, you will be prompted to confirm the event details and provide a final price for the space rental and security deposit if applicable. You will also be asked to provide an expiration date for the quote. If you do not select an expiration date, the quote will automatically expire after one week. After completing this information, the event organizer will receive an email notification that they have been sent a quote. The email will provide a link to complete booking by submitting their credit card information. Sending a quote will automatically change the status of the event from inquiry or site visit to quote slash invoice sent. Once the organizer submits payment for the event, their card will be charged and payment will be held in escrow by a third party payment processor until the event has taken place. There is a 15% commission on all booked events that originate on the Splicer website. The commission does not appear on the organizer's quote and will be taken out of the total upon payment processing. Upon completion of the event, the money will be released, processed, and in your pay in your account within three to five business days. If you do not have a pay in your account set up, then you will not be able to receive payment for an event. For more information on the Splacer management tools, please check out some of our other tutorial videos.